What's up everyone, it's my Yanti. There was only 20 second of gameplay footage, but it gives us an indication of what could be in 2K14. So much fast footage of stuff that you can see that I have to slow it down so I can elaborate a bit further. Because quite frankly, there's too much of it. Way too much. So, let's start with The Rock. Obviously, his tattoo is still there. Um, Austin, same entrance by the looks of things. Um, same camera angles for the most part. Um, but he looks pretty much identical. I don't think they've changed much of him, truth be told. Stunner, um, in the trailer for 2K14, seems to be the same stunner that's in 13. Um, loads of other years, the rock oversell, as like we like to call it. But they kept changing it and doing repeats in the trailer, so it was hard to line it up. But it does definitely look like it's uh, the same one, um, or very close to it anyway. Um, if there is a new animation, that'd be cool, but it's a stunner. I mean, there's only so many ways you can sell a stunner. Uh, same for the attitude adjustment. We've had the attitude adjustment for so long, it makes no difference. HBK's entrance in 14 looks to be different to compared to 13. WWE 12 had Macho Man, he's now in 2K14 with the classic pink attire much preferred to tie to be honest Ryback seems to be a bit more um, pink compared to being whiter and obviously there's a new shell shop with the double team finishers I've got a funny feeling that's got to be performed in a corner no way to tell just yet but it makes sense to whip both players into a corner to then do an OMG moment that's my hunch probably three finishers best guess that's how I would code it John Cena's entrance Identical new hat, new hat. You can't see me. New color T-shirt. It's John Cena. You're not going to expect much from him at all. Look, it's, look, it's, it's pretty much frame on perfect. But it's so close to identical. The elbow drop, Macho Man. I forgot to get the position right. Compare it between the two. But nice camera angle on it. Very nice camera angle. In fact, where's the cameraman? Don't know. Uh, but it looks to be the same selling on it. Which shouldn't surprise me anyway, because the elbow drop is a good move animation. When it comes to HBK, it, his animation is different, and quite frankly, his attire is far better than last year. I like the white, truth be told. Now, the mid air super kick that's in 13, and this flapper jack into a super kick, it, I think it's an OMG catch finisher variation, because the full animation seems to be pretty. Identical. I obviously didn't show the full animation, but Macho Man is definitely going to go backwards, and that's definitely going to mean it's probably that. That's my good guess on that. I don't know if many people saw that, but certainly an OMG moment in my opinion. New zigzag animation, without a doubt. Um, if it isn't, I'd be very surprised. They've got a really good camera angle, but no, it looks good. And the actual adjustment seems to be same but i mean there's no real need to change it because it's good enough as it is no point change it same for the rock bottom it's about as good as it's probably going to ever get what do you think guys of the new trailer leave in the comment section below subscribe and like for more w2k14 news oh my goodness i like this camera angle wow he's gonna die leave a like